Hello there, and welcome back to Beyond Two Souls. As you clearly read in the title, we are going to be going back in and choosing alternate choices. And just seeing the different endings, seeing how many different endings there are. Got there, Mr. Clean right there. I mean... I might as well choose different choices as well in terms of dialogue. I was just gonna do the same thing, but I already had. You down. Uh, just gonna talk over me like that, you bitch ass nigga. McGrath makes me sick. Just a typical cynical asshole. You know, I would be doing the country a favor if I let Aiden take care of him. Yeah, we played Look our out. part in all of this. <coughs> Goddamn. Um, yeah. I shouldn't have accepted that mission. That's not what I meant to click, I was only but thinking okay. Of my freedom, and that was stupid. What are you going to do now? Leave. Go somewhere far away and just try and lead a normal life. And what about you? The CIA has it all mapped out for me. Top tier, big car, golf meetings. I, mean, I haven't given him an answer yet, but it's worth considering. Like how he still said the same thing. I'm giving you new stuff and you're not giving me anything. Jody, I, I know it's been complicated between us. And I, and I didn't always do the right thing. But maybe we could start again. I'm I'm give, <laughs> give this man false hope. All the stuff we've been through. Think that's the play. <laughs> it's worth a try. From this, we gonna go straight to that other nigga, <laughs> the Native American. But. Yeah, as I was saying, I already had my story. I already did everything that I would have done in her situation. So now we just gonna do whatever. Nathan's looking for you. Come on, I'll take you to his office. Later, Ryan. Oh, you know what? I got a single malt in my office that needs sharing. Meet you in a few. Never say no to a single malt. Great. I see you in a bit. You did before when you got dumped. Fine, Andy. Also, I had just recently rewatched some clips from the X Men. I I completely forgot, bro. I was like, I know I've seen her somewhere before, and she played uh, Kitty. Is that her name? The girl that could run through walls. Ryan's a good guy, and I think he really cares about you. Pessimist. Actually, uh, I also want to see if I can prevent Nathan from offing himself. Surely, because I don't, I honestly, looking back at what I said, maybe I was being a little too, uh, realistic. I was being a little too realistic. I should have been more. All right, here we are. Call me when you're done. I'll come pick you up. Sensitive, I guess, to what he is going through. Then maybe he would have been like, "All right, she gets it." Whatever Nathan says. Be careful. <sighs> and maybe if I'm a little bit more willing to help him, because since I did refuse last time, then he was like, "Oh, you're lying," even though I wasn't. Go in. Listen here, buddy. I'll help you. Jody. But you will let your family go. So glad to see you safe. Got it. I kept my part of the bargain. Now it's the CIA's turn. I 
like those sounds effects. The CIA is concerned. You no longer exist. That's real crazy that he just like lied to me straight to my face right here. I trusted you, man. Where was you when I needed you, nigga? You're now Elizabeth North. No identity and no life. Is it more money this time? Five hundred thousand dollars. Nope. <laughs> for services rendered. That should help make a new start. Should it? I'm starting a new life. I don't want anything that reminds me of the old one. All right. Before you go, there's one last thing I'd like to ask. What that might that be, Willem? When my wife and daughter disappeared in that accident 15 years ago, I wanted to die too. I cried a lot. Most people do. <laughs> Hanging my head against the wall, trying to figure out why, why, why them. Never being able to hold them again. It was like a wound that wouldn't heal. But then you came along. And I realized they were still here all the time, near me. I just couldn't see. Gave me everything I needed to study the infra world. They were interested in military applications. I was interested in seeing my family again. It's taken me some years, but I finally succeeded in creating this. Hello, my darlings. Probably still gonna be in denial. Together. Even if I do agree to help. Working him. on a modified condenser that can communicate with the souls of the infra world. Speaking with the dead Jody. Can you imagine? What do you want from me? I want you to help me talk to them. I want to hear their voices. I want to tell them what I'm doing. Until I finish my research, you're the only one that can do it. Give me your hands. He, yeah, he's still gonna say the same thing, bro. I can already tell. What the? Bro, that was a quick turn this whole time. I just now... I am just now learning that there is a quick turn. How do you go up and stuff? There you go. Between two roles. That's not true. You're lying. I know they want to be with me again. I know they want to be with me. You wanted to talk to them. 
Hey, you heard what they had to say. Goodbye, Nathan. I hope you find peace. Well, <laughs> that didn't go any better than what happened last time. Busting a nut? What the hell was that? Okay, so here's the thing that I realized. I could have. Let's finish this. I'm pretty sure I could have just, like, not led them to Jody quick enough, and then maybe that would have been an ending. Just, like, not reaching Jody in time. Here, I can fail to shut down the condenser. which I also don't even like really understand like if I failed if I fail to shut it down is it gonna blow up and everybody dies or what I wonder what it feels like to walk through this it's called the black sun but obviously it ain't hot it's probably I guess just walking like walking through wind like some strong gas wind I can't find them Look around, Nathan! Lost souls, like you! Lost forever because you can't face the truth! I miss them! I miss them so much! Maybe there's still a chance to stop this! I know it's not what you want! I know it's not what Helen and Laura would have wanted! Imagine he just shoots me. That would kind of fuck up my mood. <laughs> that would ruin it. <laughs> if he just shot me. Is he still just going to shoot himself? Godspeed, Spider-Man. I still don't understand, understand why they take the shape of... The shape of fish. Goddamn fish ghouls. Like, leave me alone. Give me back the child. Calm down, Nora. I guess right there is where I would fail to shut down the condenser. If I just didn't tap anything, they just drag my ass down to wherever. He strangled them. We couldn't do anything. Aiden. My twin. My brother. What's that twin? Stillborn. Saturation on a hundred. We couldn't leave each other. Our souls were bound together. I loved you and hated you for years. You are a part of me. It all makes sense as to why he didn't want Ryan to hit. It's like, Jody, go find some bitches. <laughs> then maybe I'll stop fucking shit up. people 
to actually get to make a choice. Life or death. Other side. <laughs> Death looks so much more inviting too. <laughs> it's all bright. Looks like paradise. You mean so many things you had to do. Not no more. God damn, this one looks way more majestic too, bro. Look at the lighting. That was not a lovely sound. I, I'll be the one to tell you that hurt my ears. Look how big this fucking room is, bro. No wonder we were walking for so damn long. Jody, Jody. Jody, come here, wake up. Jody, wake up. Jody, wake up. Jody, wake up. Jody. 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 Jody, wake up. Is a broken man right there. That sounded like some real pain. Probably because it was. <laughs> so, uh, does it does it uh, does it just end right there, or? What? Does it not save? Is it like Detroit where it just won't save? There's a world out here whole universe of forests and lakes and mountains and rivers are those flying fish All what, what is it why is it fish i don't get it you just have to listen carefully to hear its whisper neither heaven nor hell there's no god or devil just a place where we continue to exist after we die my soul explores it endlessly and I've still only seen a fragment of it. I can be everywhere and nowhere. I can dissolve into nothing or become whole again. I can merge my soul with others or... or be more alone than any human being has ever been. All this is possible. Merely by the force of my will. I continue to look through to your world. I watch over those I love. I'd like them to know I'm there. That I'm okay. To hold them in my arms one more time. 
tell them how much I miss them. But I have to settle for being close by. Invisible. Transparent. No more than a fading memory. hell was that does it I can't even remember if that was something that they said that it gets cold in the room whenever there's an entity I thought I was gonna say little Jody <laughs> little princess I'm glad he sees that it's something like to be happy about <laughs> that would have creeped me the fuck out and dust off your damn monitor man shouldn't be that dusty I know what has been and what is yet to be I know all the possibilities I can see the darkness coming I must stay a while longer there is still a part to play before I can leave to discover what lies beyond. Yep, oh, she said it. Are we visiting everyone? Where's the baby at? Sounds like they're watching The Incredibles. <laughs> Sometimes, I could spend hours staring into space, watching the images as they go by. I play it over and over again, like a TV that's never turned off. Was she reborn? I don't know why I'm seeing all this. Or reincarnated? But there's one thing I do know. It all really happened. I thought Zoe's hair was blonde. I listened to the voice inside my head. She talks to me. She says there are things I need to know. Sometimes I shut my eyes and it's as if I could fly. I can go through walls. I see beautiful colors around people and I discover faraway places without ever leaving my room. The voice told me not to tell anyone. I'm really scared. Especially at night when I'm alone with the shadows. There are things moving in the darkness. Strange noises. Whispers in the dark. The voice says it's nothing. That it'll all go away. But she won't tell me what these things are. And I'm too scared to ask. I often have the same dream. Everything seems so real. Sounds, the smells, the light. Deep down, I know it's not just a dream. It's like an echo. An echo of things to come. I must get ready. I know there's not much time. There's only one thing I can be sure of. That theme music is so it. hard, bro. It's like a mix of the amazing spider-man 2 and like <laughs> stranger things so i mean i guess that's the reason that there hasn't been a second game is because there's so many different endings <laughs> she could have just died could have got not stopped the condenser could have died again could have came back done the epilogue ever since the black sun was destroyed my memory has been they would similar. probably have to do something similar to Telltale Games, where you like you log in with an account, and then it saves your choices. Oh, 
alone. She says it was so obvious. I just needed the silence around me to hear what I was feeling. Gotta get used to it. I told Ryan I couldn't see my future with him. We've been through too many difficult times together. Uh, times I want to why'd he turn around and start walking? Where are you gonna walk? Through the grass, you dumbass? <laughs> that he'd wait as long as it takes. I know I felt something for him. It just wasn't strong enough. Uh-huh. How could I live a normal life again after all I've been through? Hell, who wants to live a normal life anyway? Nobody. Boyfriend, job, counting the days till my next vacation. I wanted it for so long, but I finally realized that that life wasn't for me. Nobody so wants a normal run. life. But there are some who will settle. I've seen many rifts to the other side. Hundreds of them all over the country. What the hell? Homes where strange things happen. Motel rooms that no one ever wants to sleep in again. Entities are all around us. They live in our houses. They sleep in our beds. They're with us every second of every day. I know they're lurking in the shadows. The way they just blink out of existence. Is it gonna end the same way with the whole big ass condenser? Her talking about future looking like cable. No? Really? Imagine just having to get used to that shit, bro. Oh, thank you. You don't know how much I've missed you. Still not a bad ending. Yeah, yeah, fucking see this shit again. This is like the true ending. <laughs> Terrifying things. I tell myself it's only nightmares, but I know it's not true. Once Pandora's box is open. Can never be closed again. No, it's not nightmares. It's what is about to happen. I've died twice already. I'm not afraid of death anymore. She. <laughs> Yeah, that line cold, brother. That line cold as hell. All right, here we go. I guess uh, uh Jay. So obvious. Might as well do it in order. Deep inside, I I always knew. No, you I didn't. The <laughs> to this was, was easily the most random choice. I told Ryan I couldn't see my future with him. We've been through too many difficult times together. Times I want to forget. A blue vest with a green sweater, bro. That he'd wait as long as it takes. I was about to say, did you get dressed in the I dark or blind? Him. But then I realized he does only have one eye. It just wasn't strong enough. Traveled all the way back to the desert.
How are we pulling up? Sup, bitches. <laughs> Long time no see. That run. What the hell was that? <laughs> the least amount of chemistry in like any game ever. First day back and they already fucked. That's crazy. In the desert too, bro. These wood walls. <laughs> His full family, but I heard everything. And then the same ending. <laughs> I see things at night. That was by far the worst so far out of all of them like that. <laughs> Terrifying things. <laughs> Just ends with that scene like alright. I honestly want to know who chose that on their first uh, run through because that one just really doesn't make any sense to me. Last so but not least, deep inside, I the loser. <laughs> the no backbone. The, the lame ass. To hear what I was feeling. She outside his crib. It took me a while to realize how much I love Ryan. I've been alone and sad for so long. I, I've forgotten what it was like to love someone. Man, just dropped all his groceries like that. It just goes to the future thing, I'm gonna be annoyed. It's probably gonna do a still here for Aiden thing, actually. We traveled as far away as we could. I had to learn to love again. To put my trust in someone to stop fighting and running away. short I had to learn to live Ryan and I never talked about it again why would you as if it all never happened don't want to relive none of those memories as if the other side didn't exist as if it could never come back into our lives Look at that sunset. On a random island? Where Jack Sparrow at? Yeah. 
Yo, the sun busting in the background. That is a whole screenshot right there. Whole screensaver. That was clean. That shit clean too. Is he gonna draw it in the sand? What the fuck? <laughs> huh? How the hell? Where did it come from? Yeah, I know it. You're gonna draw in the sand. Looks like she finally found the chapstick. After all these years. <laughs> This one was better than Jay's, I'll say that. Mainly because of the sunset and the beach. Nice! So, uh, yeah, we did it. <laughs> That's all the endings that I care to see. Um, I still think that Zoe was the most fulfilling and satisfying ending. So the homeless people were the most genuine. I know it's not and actually, true. well, they weren't like, they weren't perfect people, but they were good-hearted people. So that's all that matters, right? To, to me, anyways. No. It's not nightmares. Then, it's then. Well, that's the end. I'm not afraid of death anymore.